I'm Anil Kumar and here is a test question for my students to find greatest common factor using Venn diagram. Well, you can pause the video, copy the question, solve and then look into my suggestions. Now here we need to list out factors of the numbers. These are the two numbers given to us, 24 and 40. Using Venn diagram, we have to use this Venn diagram. Then find the greatest common factor. So first step here is to find all possible factors of the numbers given to you. You can make that rainbow to ensure that you have all factors listed. Once you list factors, find which are common factors, then place them in the Venn diagram. From the Venn diagram, you can see the greatest common factors, right? And then write your answer. Okay, so you can still pause the video, solve the question, and then look into my suggestion. So let's write down factors for 24. 1 times 24 is 24. Start with 1. 2 times 12 is 24. 3 times 8 is 24. 4 times 6 is 24. And then 8 times 3. So it repeats, right? So I think these are all the possible factors of 24. Let us connect them. I mean, it's not necessary. I'm just showing you that it forms kind of a rainbow, right? It helps to understand. And we have all the factors. How about 40? 1 times 40, correct. 2 times 20, right? 3, it doesn't go with. 4 times 10. 5 times 8, right? 6 times 7 times 8. 8 times 5. So that is all, right? So we have factors of 40 also. So these are the factors. 1 times 40, 2 times 20, 4 times 10, 5 times 8. 6 factors. Now out of these factors, which are common? So what we find here is that we have 1 always will be a common factor. Then we have 2 as common, right? What else? 4 is common. Perfect. Uh, do we have any other common factor? Yes, 8 is common. Okay. Now, anything else is common? No. These are the common factors. So, first place all the common factors right in the center. They are common to both. So, 1, 2, 4 and 8. 1, 2, 4 and 8 will go in the center. These are the common factors. List other factors. Now, where? You can say one first circle is factors of 24. So write down factors of 24. And for the other circle, we will write factors of 40. So the other circle is factors of 40, right? Now we can list 1, 2 and 4 are already there. They are common factors. We are left with 3, 6, 12 and 24. So 3, 6, 12 and 24 are factors of 24 but not of 40. That's what we mean. If you count, you know all of them have been taken care of. Now list factors of 40. 1, 2, 4 and 8 is taken care of. 5, 10, 20, 40 is left. So we'll write 5, 10, 20 and 40 for factors of 40. Now from this, we have a common group which is this one. That is common factors. So now we can list them. We say common factors are 1, 2, 4 and 8. Out of which greatest common factor is 8. Correct? So that is how you get your greatest common factor using Venn diagram. I hope that helps. Thank you.